I feel like they always do that. Like every fuck. I forgot how loud that was. I feel like that happens with every major AAA publisher because they they don't like spending money on anything sensible. <laughs> I keep forgetting how fucking loud that was. Or that is. It's not even really that loud on your end. It, it was really fucking loud on my end, though. I'm saving that. I'm also saving that. Alright, so we looked at this yesterday. Oh. I have, like, no ammo for that. Alright. Do you want a really loud song? Is it Sanic? I've gotten that before. This is what... I, I think you've probably linked Cruelty Squad's music before. Yeah, I I've actually heard some of those tracks. Uh, I think Vinny might have played it a little bit, like, before he started streaming a lot less. It's... it's funny, like... I don't really consider it a detriment, but Cruelty Squad's music just makes me feel uncomfortable. I think that's the point. God damn it. Hold on. I'm waiting for this to... There we go. And hey, I got a hundred mega armor again. Good doggo. Vinny clown the game, the apartment missions music really fits what's happening in that. Mission. Your landlord called the police because you were late on your rent and Cruelty Squad themselves are trying to assassinate you. So you have all these guys running around with automatic fletched shotguns. It did. It seemed like Vinny kind of enjoyed it, though. I don't know. I, I didn't want... I think I watched it when he was actually streaming it, not, like, the, uh, the playback. That definitely seems like a game that I could probably only play in, like, two-hour intervals, though. It seems like it's a really good game, and a really unique game on top of it. But it just seems like a game that make As weird as this sounds, it seems like a game where its whole point is to make you feel uncomfortable. But, like, not in a way where you don't want to play it. If that makes any sense. Like, uh, the curiosity about where the game is going is, like, so great that you still want to play it. Is there a dog? Hey, doggo. I'm still not sure if the different doggos do different damage or not. Different damage types or not.
You should be tactically aware, but you should also be aware of how to break the map. They've specifically designed the game to have you break it. That's actually, that is actually quite interesting. I don't think Vinny realized how important headshots were, even the shooting gallery range in Cruelty Squad makes it obvious you should aim for the head. To be fair, Vinny will often say that he often misses the point. And more often than not, I say the same thing, too. I do try to watch, like, lately, whether or not to call something trash. Sometimes, maybe I'm just trash, or maybe I'm just missing the point of what the game is trying to go for. The fuck is that noise? I don't know where that's coming from. Fuck? Is that... Is that the icon of sin? No, it's... The Tomb Eternal, uh... Arc file. I have not seen him yet. He's... I'm guessing the thing that makes him different from the base Arc file is that he... He probably empowers demons if they're nearby. I'm assuming that. That was just a really bad part for him to spawn in because he couldn't do it if he can. There's no other enemies around him. Alright, uh... I kind of want to see wh what that entry is. Yeah, we saw that was the Mall Wrath. What the hell is that one? Ah, uh, he calls the Doom Eternal Pain Elemental the Beholder. And the Doom 64 alternate is Rehov Rehovar? That's a fiend. He calls the Doom 64 Mancubus the Behemoth. Arcvile, Summoner. Inf he calls it the Infernus. It's Arcvile orders. Air command allowing them to cast. Lesser hexes upon opponents outside of their line of sight in a bid to flush them out into the open. Where lesser Arcviles demonstrate a child like Glee, the Infernus radiates supreme, almost smug confidence and knows it's better than everyone else in the battlefield and is more happy to prove it. Doesn't really explain what he actually does, though. Oh, that was Eternal's Arachnatron, alright. Uh oh, the hell is shooting at me? Oh god damn it! <laughs> it was still a good idea, but still now I have to wait. I can get that. I think I have to come back here too, because well no, I don't have to, but that is Yeah, I can just go back through this, right? Damn it. I didn't mean to pick that up. You know what? I didn't lose that much progress. I really don't want to use that unless I really need to.
just in case there's nothing actually here worth it. Oh good, this, this just brings me back up. Right. Nice hit and run, you little shit. could get that. Yeah, maybe I should just get that real quick. Just in case I'm a I'm an idiot and I pick that up again. All right. Video is 32 seconds long, but there's another on the mission in space. It's like 16 seconds long. I should cackle that one during one of its streams because I wanted to see it. Hilariously dumb speed running can get. Considering how abstract this game is, I doubt I'll remember this anyway. Well, he has like a hook shot thing. No wonder how he's breaking the level so easily. Can the literally kill your target in that map by busting a window and firing a rocket. Oh. Fuck. Even the red ones are easier to get than these guys. I didn't mean to pick that up. What the fuck? He teleported! Oh, screw this dog. Be funny if someone actually ported the Doom RPG stuff to GZ Doom. I'm surprised no one's done it yet. Like, literally bring the entire game, the entire RPG games to this. Wait, this just brings me to the same spot. Got that already. Uh. Well, I know there's something there I can get. And I got this already. I haven't gone this way. Oh, I could have. And I didn't want to pick that up. Doom 2 RPG gets the holy water pistol. Like game demons, you can't googly eye them though. They get googly eyes? I'm surprised Kinsey didn't implement that. 
Maybe he couldn't figure out a, a way to do it without it looking bad. commotion up there. Yeah, I, I don't think that, uh, <laughs> I don't think there's any way for, uh, Kinsey to probably implement that without making specific sprites for that. You'd have to make sprites for each demon to have those googly eyes. I think that's a little too much trouble for what it's worth. Uh, I don't think I can make it there from here. <laughs> Not from up here, not from there either. Oh, I've been here already. I do like that this map maker put these on the ground to tell you where to go next. I'm just incredibly oblivious and didn't realize that until now. God damn it. Fucking dogs. Oh wow, they're fighting each other. I'm a little surprised by that, actually, because they're the same enemy types. They're just... Different, uh... I, I guess it's because they're... They're not the exact same enemy. Hoping not to use the dog, but that was taking way too long. Kinsey would probably have to make a metric. Hit. Oh, that's exactly what I said. All right. <laughs> to get him sooner. I was really, really slow to react there. Oh. Hmm. 
I can get I can get to there from here. I almost thought I had to like go all the way back up again. Thank God I only fell on the bottom platform. Turn random sound pitches into the sound options menu. Does that make the Revenant Tracer? <coughs> In Meta Doom, beep randomly too. Let's find out. I normally don't like it when you. How they sound when you do that, but I'll do it for science's sake. I forget where it. Is that in sound options? No. Miscellaneous. I forget where that's at. I know what option you're talking about, though. Oh. Randomized pitches, there it is. <clears throat> yeah, forgive me if I'm a tad slow today, but uh, it's my second day off and... Uh... I already started drinking. And it's also humid as shit. Actually, yeah, I should turn up my AC a little bit more. Humidity actually does make me kind of loopy. <coughs> and apparently it makes me cough a little. Did I get them all? Killed about half the enemies in the level. I don't think I got them all yet. Nope. I have a few, actually. is that I didn't even know it did that oh, hi there this way yet. That sounds so weird. Wait. It's supposed to be a way for modders to explicitly define a sound to not be random pitched even if that option is turned on. Interesting. And I hear thunder outs. We, we did get a severe thunderstorm warning. So, uh, yeah, FYI, if uh, the power suddenly goes out, you, you know why. I think it is kind of, but not really. I actually think I can make that. Oh my god, that sounds so weird. Those are heavy as fuck uh, raindrops, Jesus. Yeah, I can get that. Nice.
I think I got that already, so. I don't know if you can hear it hitting my air conditioner, but man, those are loud. How do I... Yeah, that's gotta be a secret. I might actually start... Hold on. Yeah, I think it's inside... Yeah, it is. really use this to see where I've been, though, because I've been to several spots that I didn't get the, the switch for. What is this? Symbol of the Raven. God, they sound weird. <laughs> they sound even weirder. The dogs sound alright. at each other. Soul Cube, huh? Oh no, that wasn't the, the Soul Cube, that was the heart. Why is that not a weapon, though? Hold on. Oh, it's literally just... <laughs> That's kind of, that's good. I like that. Oh, it's an item. Alright. I forgot. Yeah, it is an item. It's stop and it probably does what it does in Doom 3, which is to stop time. I probably could have used it there. I don't know why I didn't. See any Peterson is still alive and kicking. What if someone paid the guy a thousand dollars to do a Doom Eternal the way Sandy did? Interesting concept. <laughs> and have like every. Have like uh, every single map 
like at the bottom every so often, like John Romero will just chime in as, uh, hey Sandy, hope you're, hope you're having a good day. Actually, this and this. That would be like the best thing <laughs> ever. A siphon grenade? Yeah, I need to start using this. Not on them, though. Maybe on the pinky. I fucked that up, but it worked. Danny did do a video talking about things happening during Quake's development. I would love to know if uh, John Romero watched that one. And if people don't know what I was referring to earlier, uh, Sandy was actually talking about some of that stuff on Twitter. And John Romero kept politely correcting him on things. I didn't mean to pick this up, but I might as well use it. There's another one there anyway, if I need it. Uh... How many of them did I get at this point? Oh shit. <laughs> The things talked about in that video is a giant zombie boss where you had to run around several scaffoldings to strategically attack the boss. Yeah, I wouldn't be so high there, beautiful. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, there was a lot. Yeah, there was a lot of cut content for Quake. Didn't they redevelop it from scratch? It does that. Definitely makes sense. Ah. I shouldn't have interrupted that. I like when it says use us. Oh no, wait, it doesn't say that until it's fully charged, my bad. Still. Nice sound effects. Even the, uh... You know, like, every single sound effect has the pitch randomized. It's throwing me off so much. <laughs> yeah, fuck it, I'll pick it up. You know, that sounds weird, but it also sounds like it should be accurate. Those gears would be making, uh, random noises. Oh, they're up there. Yeah, so it's probably going to be like an RPG or something like that, but, uh, I forget, didn't, like, half the team, like, they made it into a first-person shooter because I don't think development was going well, and they kind of redesigned, redecided, uh, you know what, why don't we just continue to do what we know rather than experiment, because this is not working. I think it had. I think I remember hearing something about that. God, that sounds so weird.
And I kind of want to go down there and get that, but I think I'd have to go... No, nah, nah, you know what? I can get it now. Forgot which Commander Keen it was, but I mentioned early idea for Quake and the credits for upcoming products from its software. Yeah, I only know that it wasn't the first one. No, never mind. I don't know what, which one it was. It could have been the first one. But I know what you're talking about. I remember that too. Oh, okay. Easy, easier way to get around now. Oh. My god, did it get humid. I put my EC up even higher. I mean, I am also sweating because I'm drinking, but... I think I got them all now. No, I didn't. No, I did. Fuck. Now, those soul essences used to drop a lot more. He nerfed that in, uh, in version 7. I used to get the soul cube charge, like, all the time. Right, you know what? We can use it now. Okay, Palladium. Oh man, I got him. I think I got them all yet. No. Yeah, I did. I found five C What the fuck is that in the lower left? That was just rooms. Huh, how do I get to that? I thought that was an arrow pointing to something. Hmm. There is one spot here that I didn't get. Yeah, right there. I'm pretty sure. Not sure how exactly to get it. Oh, alright. Thought I tried that already. You have a bunch of ammo for that now.
There isn't really a spot I haven't been on the map at this point, though. Yeah, I already got that. I mean, obviously, there's like three more secrets, so there's spots I haven't been to yet. I noticed that area in the bottom left corner, but I'm not quite sure if it's actually worth it to try. Ah! Wait. I have it already, never mind. But that's more Argent cells, I'm still going for it. Uh -uh. Oh, I should save. <laughs> I should save right, but I didn't save right before I did that, did I? No, I didn't. He's so slippery when he sprints. But you have to sprint like 99% of the time, so why take it off? Oh, wait, this way, right? Yeah. I should take it from an angle. Good God. I just have so much momentum. I have so much momentum. There we go. How many... I'm full now. Did I... I don't think so. I remember you... I know Tri... Tribe 1 is like a ridiculous... Uh, he, you're ridiculously fast in that, aren't you? I think that's all I want to get to. There is one more enemy left on the map, but it's probably just a lost soul. Actually, I think I heard an imp. Really? Uh, it's I, I did all that for nothing. God damn it. There was someone asking about how the player damage function works because the percent mom and the percent momentum were asking if it was literally the player's mom. <laughs> you little shit. End my life, you fucker. There. You know what? I'm cheesing this. You are going to die my to my pistol and you're gonna like it. I broke the map. <laughs> Fuck it, he's an arc file. <laughs> I mean, uh, I did kind of break it because, uh, conventionally, I don't think you can kill him in 50 handgun bullets. Hope you have a way to enable. Ju yeah, I'm definitely not. Well, he has jump enabled already. I 
I hate arc vile jumps so much, though. I, I really do. <laughs> I'm almost not sorry that I just broke it. Wait. Oh. Alright, that explains the arc vile. Played Hideous Destructor, so I always enable jump and crouch regardless. Yeah, this is my first time playing it, playing uh, Unnecessary, so... Normally I would want to respect his rules, but... Fuck Archiviles. Yeah, I'm guessing... Yeah, we're, we're just gonna jump through this. Sorry, I, I get what he's trying to do. But most likely, if I were playing this vanilla, I'd probably just skip this level. Not gonna lie, I know, I know that there's people that have patience for this stuff, but not me. Does he really intend for you to get launched over there? How would you, though? I'm trying to think. When you get launched by an arc file, is it the position that he's staring at you, or is it the position that you're looking? Because I can't just conventionally jump there if the arc vials uh, thing, the arc vials ability to push you is uh, bigger than the conventional jump. thinking so, because that one's there. I wonder, would he expect you to actually get up there with an arc while jump? That seems like it's too high. Oh, there's two more in here. I didn't go in here yet. Normally, I would. Re I do feel bad. Normally, I would respect puzzles. I just. Arc vile jumps always irritate me. Oh, and this is the exit. Alright. Yeah, we'll just we'll just call this level a wash. This isn't map 26. I gotta see something. That is me, alright. This one's probably broken too because of Meta Doom. I really should have done this vanilla. And this is mainly the reason why I think that. If I get any of these guys that charge, uh, they'll set off every... I'll set off every one of them. Okay, 
Okay, so you do have some that shoot. So maybe it's not designed that way. Just gotta be very careful about where me and uh, they're shooting. Because again, if any one of these things goes off, I'm dead. Gotta be very careful with this thing. Am I a joke to you? Okay, well at least that threat's gone. Only 16 enemies in the. Th this is like the strangest assortment of maps ever. I, I think I will replay this on vanilla though. I can't guarantee that I won't skip map 21, but still. I do want to give this a fair shot at some point. In fact, I should probably mark it as such. Way. It's did it stop? No, I didn't stop. Neat. Do like that. Oh. Hi there. Okay then, we're just gonna, we're just gonna pretend that, uh, maybe we did do everything as intended, I don't know. <laughs> I'm just kinda like, going out of that with an okay then.
I have absolutely no idea what he's going for here. All of a sudden, I just got crushed, and I don't know how. Oh, that's how. It almost feels like their tracer sounds bugged out. They just weren't playing. Oh, no, wait, never mind. They just never fire their shots, I don't think. Crimson Head did the, uh... Normal Red Head didn't. Try it again. Sorry, it's hard to beat instinct. Why are your homing shot? I kind of forgot I had still had quad damage. Oh, it does. <laughs> it sounds so weird. Why I had Dan turn random pitches on when he was playing Project Brutality because of the beat boops. <laughs> I forgot to save, but I'm actually kind of glad I did. Uh, and now I'm way worse off. Nice. Forgot I have that. The second I see that arc file, I'm pulling that out.
mind. That Cyberman was just made sure I never saw the arc file again. Just so we can move this along, I'm gonna save right here. Where is that arc file? I hear him. I don't think he comes in until a little later. There he is. He's protected by like a group of revenants. That's why he's so hard to get. God, he has a lot of health. 
Oh, wait, did I kill him? I think I killed him. Yeah, I killed him. I think I was using the uh, BFG a little too conventionally. I forgot the uh, 2016 and Eternal one relies more on the tracers than an actual direct hit. Watch this be another death exit. Still gonna look for more resources just in case. I did Mancubus while teleporting to the exit. Oh, are you fucking serious? I like 100% think, or 90% think, not 100%. There's still some doubt there, but I'm 90% sure that this is a death exit. Three secrets in the level, and I haven't gotten any of them. I think I'm actually locked out of them because uh, one of them was probably that invulnerability sphere. Oh, thank god. Thank god I was 10% wrong. this map already. I don't think I'm supposed to shoot. Yeah, quiet, please. Get them to fight each other. Nikes. Rocket League 2.0, what the fuck? I've done maps like that before. Where well, you're not supposed to- what? 
There is just no music on this one at all. This is map 26. Why is this area blocked, though? So I'm wondering, is it bugged out because of this? Yeah, it's weird, though, because I don't have that enabled, so I don't know how they're blocking my way. Yeah, that's weird. I don't have the infinite height thing enabled, so I don't know why they actually blocked it. I think this was supposed... Maybe it's because Metadoom changes how the barrels work. I think that was supposed to make this explode. It might ch it might make their splash damage smaller. I don't know. Oh shit. Oh yeah. I can't shoot over that because it's uh, an invisible wall. I don't know if I'm supposed to get them to do something. I think I'm supposed to get them to do something. Yeah. Hold on. Uh, let's try this again. Maybe this is also why... Uh, as much as much as I think that this is actually pretty... A pretty nice design. This looks like it'd be so annoying, though, if you do it conventionally. I think, yeah, I, I definitely know what he's trying to go for. You're supposed to get the homing rockets to destroy these. Now, I think you could probably do it anyway, since you still have, like, the rocket launcher and shit. Because wouldn't it still set it off, since it has the infinite height? They have to launch a homing rocket. None of them want to launch the homing rocket, though. I just kind of want to see if I can 
I wonder if Kinsey programmed them to where they don't launch the homing rocket unless you're closer? I don't know. They're not doing it, they're just launching the normal one. This might be this might be a no, there we go. Alright. I know they both both types of uh, revenants do launch the homing rocket. They just really don't want to launch it though. Got it. They really don't want to launch the homing rockets. Kinsey must have set it to a less percent for them to do it. Again, I'm not sure if it's a greater percent if you're closer. They just really don't want to launch the homing rockets. not what I want you to do. He is the only one and he keeps using the, keeps using the micro missiles. I'm just doing this to see if it coaxes them to do it and I didn't realize he did it until much later. Yeah, maybe they do it more when their health is lower. Not that one. Boner. God fucking damn it. There we go. You know what's interesting? He said this wouldn't work if you didn't enable infinite height. I am 100% certain that infinite height's not enabled. I think... Where would I go for that? To check. Gameplay options? Yeah, where would that be at? Actor behavior, map action behavior, maybe? I don't know. I don't know where that'd be. And Meta Doom adds additional options. So, oh shit, they're in. They're in fighting. That's not good. They can't see me from back here. Also, they already blew up some of these. I think. Oh, yeah. 
So now they're doing it all the time. I gotta hit it one more time. Oh, alright. Oh, now I can kill him. Honestly, I thought this was the map that was going to be broken, and this one actually worked. It was two other... It was the Arc Vial map that was kind of broke. Well, I was the one that broke it, because uh, I'm stubborn. But I thought this was the map that I was going to break. I don't know if the map maker might have done something to force the collision like that, but... Because I'm pretty sure I don't have that enabled. Yeah, I might be able to finish this before my first break. I only have like three maps left. Hello, Jerry. Eighty six. recognition I almost feel like you can kind of cheese this just by, uh, saves. <laughs> Do you like total Doom Wad conversion? If you mean, do I like to play Total Conversions, uh, yes. I've been meaning to get to Total Chaos, but I have played Golden Souls. I think I've played a few others. I don't know if you'd consider Winter's Fury a Total Conversion. Oh my god, I hate Summoner! Me. Yeah, I had like two health. <laughs> Let's go this way. Should use the alt fire to try and get rid of them. I'm not really sure what it's trying to get at, though. It has to do with these, yeah, but... 
Like, what does it actually have to do with is the thing. Like, why the patterns? And... All that jazz. This way, then. Fuck. More arc vials. Or not. It's on ultra violence. I still don't know what exactly the the pattern's supposed to mean. This is probably the most abstract uh puzzle in this map pack so far. This one's also certain death. I don't think I'm going to save. <sighs> I hate you. <laughs> hey, the Unmaker, though. Save. Saving might have been a bad idea now that I think about it. <laughs> Saving was an incredibly bad idea. Saving was an incredibly bad idea. Saving was an incredibly bad idea. The B use the last pattern to see you match it up to the correct path. I have no clue because the exit's opening in this last section. It might just have to do with the enemies that spawn.
think I can do it as long as the arc file dies first. If the arc file doesn't die first, then, uh, yeah. Most assuredly dead. Honestly, there, there was probably some sort of pattern recognition recognition there. If there was, I have no clue. Whoa, what the fuck? What the fuck is happening? Oh, that's what was happening. All right. That was, yeah, that was like 95% luck. <laughs> if I had the heart there, it would have made things a hell of a lot easier. Wait, it's only map 28. I'm already fighting the Icon of Sin? Hang on. Oh, there's two more maps. Hell's Gall Gallbladder and Sins of the Icon. Wait, I already fucked it up. I wonder if you're just not supposed to fire. Try not to fire for as long as possible. He had to put an arc file there. Of course, he had to put an arc file there. He actually put two arc files there. Of course, he was going to burn me. I think this is a hell of a lot easier now. Never mind, I already ate shit. Revenant bastard's gonna die. Assuming you just have to wait until this is completely down. If I run into trouble, I'll use the heart. Actually, yeah, why don't I just use it now? Oh, 
Oh. There we go. Alright, that wasn't nearly as long as I thought it would be. I thought that would be a hell of a lot longer. Hell's Gallbladder. Nice name. Unfortunately, this one might be impossible because I think he increased the uh, splash damage on the rocket launcher, but I could be wrong. I don't know. I feel like Kinsey increased the splash damage on the rocket launcher. I think that's why I keep killing myself. So this may or may not be impossible. We're gonna give it the old college try though. No, wait, you know what? This is probably the way he intends you to do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think... I think that's the way you're supposed to do it. You're supposed to try and get it so that the splash damage kills them. Uh, which may or may not be harder with this mod. But it may not be impossible. problem is, is if they, if you don't kill them fast enough, then you just don't have enough room and you die. I do get the point, though. I don't think this is impossible. I think it's just harder with this mod. Not necessarily move right, but yeah, straight and keep to the edges. I'm killing myself because I'm losing way too much health too early. direct rocket hit.
wasn't kidding when he said this is Hell's Gallbladder. Definitely not. That works. Sins of the Icon. It's I'm very curious how he's handling this one. FYI for anyone new here, I really hate the Icon of Sin. I like the different interpretations that mods do of the Icon of Sin, but I don't like vanilla Icon of Sin. I like Doom Eternal's uh, Icon of Sin. I, I don't like Classic Doom's uh, Icon of Sin. I hate Final Doom's even more, and the Master Level can go suck eggs. <laughs> That being said, sometimes people put nice spins on it in mods. Oh, I see. Alright, this is actually pretty cool, though. You have to try and make it so that the Icon of Sin kills the Cyber Demons. Actually, we'll try this again. Now that I know what I'm supposed to be doing. There is a secret. I wonder if it's here. Guess it's not here. I ran right into that. What's your favorite interpretation of the Icon of Sin fight? Honestly, I think uh, the design in Brutal Doom is pretty good. Maybe not the Hell on Earth starter pack, but I kind of like how we approached it when you play it when you play like the vanilla Doom Two maps. I think I just blanked out there. Wonder if that worked. I think the icon of sin always launches in that view, right? So maybe I should just stay down here. Oh shit. Sure. Never mind. I just wasn't look I, I am not looking at those rockets at all. Some of them I'm... Either I'm just blanking out and I'm really oblivious, or, uh... Like, man. I am just being really bad. It seems like he always launches it at the first one. That's weird. Or... It might travel. Yeah, it travels. Alright, I'm saving it after that. So it homes in on you, I think. Oh, 
he's too close. I have to action kill him. Rockets sometimes when they launch them. They're tinier or just less noticeable, and that Kakodim just cut the fuck out of me. Wow, what the fuck? How did that one die? Okay, I like his twist on the Icon of Sin a lot. Sometimes people get creative with it in pretty decent ways. That one I actually really liked. Alright, uh, perfect timing too. 